Hello and welcome back. So today's video we are talking about how to maximize these Titan shards. So I am going to show you a strategy that you can go ahead and do. This probably works better on a inactive server because you can go ahead and make sure that you are getting all of the Titan shards. And what you need to do is have two accounts. So it, you can see right over here, um, this is another one of my accounts. This is uh, Connor Ghost Hunter, I believe is the name of this account. And then here is Connor Monster Tamer. So both of us have joined a battle that I created. So first I created in this account, then I went to the other account. Now we're gonna go ahead and start the battle. And uh, here we're gonna come out. I'm going to be the only one that's getting the hits in, Real, really. I need, do need to go over to the other account to go ahead and do this. But this is going to ensure that I'm getting four uh, Titan shards without having anyone else in uh, the battle. So if you are trying to gather Titan shards at a time where no one else is playing, this is a great strategy to go ahead and do um, in order to make sure that you are getting those. Even if there is a bump for Titan shards, I really don't think they'll go over 10 Titan shards per battle for members, but hopefully it does go to 5 for non-members and uh, 10 for members. Um, if there is a bump, I think this will still work in order to make sure you're maximizing the amount of Titan shards that you are getting. So you can see here, you do have to answer a fair more questions. If you want to split it evenly, both of your accounts should get about four uh, um, uh, Titan shards. You can probably go ahead and play it by ear. But I think if this account, I pull it all the way down to here, I switch to the other account, I should be able to go ahead and do that. I actually might go ahead and test this theory out right now just to see if I can go ahead and maximize for both accounts. Um, that would be ideal. All right, so you've done about half of the Titan hits here. Now I'm going to go ahead and just switch right straight over to this screen here, which it's just starting out right now. Um, I did turn off the audio in uh, Connor Ghost Hunter, so uh, we're not going to be hearing any real sounds from the battle. Just because two you know, accounts blasting music would be a little bit intense, so at least for me. So that's the hit. We're just going to go through uh, Connor Ghost Hunter. I think he is probably in the... Um, uh, Maybe in the in, in the placement test still. I, I played him a little bit last night, um, but he's very, very low. I just wanted to make sure I would be able to go ahead and get him into this Titan battle. All right, and then here we go. We're just about finished with our battle. Let's see if both of these accounts will get four stars, or four Titan shards if we split the difference, which I think is about five questions per hit, and hopefully we'll be able to finish this guy off. I lost a Titan battle, uh, I think it was uh, yesterday, which I wasn't really, I had no idea you could lose Titan battles, or I guess it's been such a long time since I've lost one that uh, it, it shocked me. So let me know in the comments if you have ever done this. Let me know in the comments if you are doing this theory or this this uh, um, method, and if uh, not, let me know what you think. All right, skill complete. So make sure you do celebrate these skill completes. And also a rank up, woot woot. All right, so here we go. We're going to see if we can get our four Titan Shards here for Connor, Mo Connor Ghost Hunter. And let's see, that's the Titan hit. All right, we'll open up the chest. Four Titan Shards, yes. So uh, Connor got four Titan Shards. Ghost Hunter got four Titan Shards. Let's come on over here and see what happens here. I don't know if I still have to answer one more question. We'll see. We're just going to watch this sort of play out. And Connor Ghost Hunter is just going to be going absolutely crazy right now. And there we go. There we go. So this is about the same length as just one Titan battle. Um, but I think this will go ahead and maximize the amount of shards and the amount of gear that you can get. So if you do have two accounts that are kind of main, you know, you have your main main one and then you have another one that you grind pretty hard on. This is going to be a strategy where you will be able to get four shards, maximum shards for two different accounts at the same time. So definitely check this out. Definitely do this. Um, this will help you to go ahead and 
or melt uh, this, this, <laughs> this will be able cycle. to um, uh, go ahead and make sure that you are getting as many Titan Shards as you can in order to get this up with very little hassle. Um, this probably does work, like I said, best on a server where there really is not a lot of people on it. So um, uh, let me know what you think about this. I think this is going to be super helpful for me, especially when there aren't people that are here. Uh, ben Iceblade looks like he wants to duel, but I am going to pass on that. Their next uh, battle party will be coming up super soon, but I might be playing with Ben Iceblade uh, if I have time to go ahead and do that. Uh, be sure to like, be sure to subscribe. It is super helpful. The comments help our channel to grow. Uh, next live is going to be on Saturday where I attempt a full walkthrough um, from the very beginning of the game to the end to see how it plays. What's the storyline now? Just to really get a better under better understanding of what's going on. So stop on by for a little while. If you uh, choose, I should be on most of the day, I think. So uh, take care. Keep on prodiging on. Bye-bye.